What is up guys, today I'm going to teach you how to edit off of your hard drive on the MacBook Pro. Should be the same on the MacBook Air. As you can see, my laptop does not have a lot of gigabytes. Like 150 I believe is what came with this one. So what you do need is a hard drive because eventually your computer is going to run out of space and trying to upload videos is going to be really hard because it's gonna slow down your computer. So, as you can see, I hopped on here into iMovie. I'm going to be showing you how to make a library that is exclusively for your external hard drive. As you can see, I only have the iMovie library. At least that is what you could only see, right? And now, this is just me signing into my you know, hard drive, just showing you guys how much you need one because as you can see, it gives me an additional 500 gigabytes that I could just solely just put all my footage in there. As you can see, I already have one, but I'm going to make one for you guys. You can name your new library whatever you want. Just make sure that where it is stored is on your external hard drive or solid state drive. Because that will be the only way that you're going to be able to edit off of the hard drive. Right? Now we're going to go ahead and test it and upload a clip from literally like what you're seeing right now. We're going to upload some footage right there that you previously saw at the beginning of this video. Now when you exit from iMovie and you go back in, you might not be able to see where your new library is. So what you're going to do for that is you're pretty much just going to go ahead and click on file and you know, open up your library and then right there you should see the new option of the library you just created. And that's how you basically edit off of your hard drive. There's another way for you to open up the library, which is when you're creating a new movie, right? It gives you the option to go ahead and use that new library. So now that you know how to edit off of an external hard drive, this is the way to go when you go ahead and move videos and photos from your memory card onto your external hard drive. So you can free up storage in your internal hard drive and you stop your laptop from crashing or being extremely slow. And this is the way to also increase your editing speed from editing off of an external hard drive. I hope you guys found this video helpful. Make sure to give it a thumbs up so more people that have this problem can go ahead and watch this video and finally solve that problem. Thank you guys so much for watching my videos as always and I'll be seeing you in my next video hopefully. Peace.